Here at home in Austin, homeowners, you could get a big opportunity, a little break to save some money. That's if City Council approves a proposal to double the homestead tax exemption to 20%. Members are going to take that final vote later on today. And the city expects the money that would save the average homeowner about $141 a year. Hey, that old Brackenridge Hospital off of Red River and 15th Street in downtown Austin could soon be the site of a new development. Austin City Council will consider the idea today. The current landowner is Central Health and it's making the request. The land at 15th and Red River could be used for offices, medical facilities, shops, and housing. City Council's vote is to rezone the property it would be the first step in making it all happen. We have details about the future of this project right now on KXAN. Just search Breckenridge. Well, today, City Council will vote on buying a hotel to help people experiencing homelessness. This hotel is in the part of Austin that's located up in Williamson County, and not everyone's on board with the idea. People against the idea held a protest yesterday at City Hall. The hotel in question is the Candlewood Suites on Pecan Park Boulevard. Williamson County leaders have contemplated and complained to the city that it's kept them out of the loop on this issue. County Judge Bill Gravel telling KXN he's planning to sue Austin if council gives the go ahead on buying the property. From the perspective of Williamson County, I just simply want to say this. We're going to stand up for our business owners. We're going to stand up for our community. Uh, we're going to stand up for our citizens. And listen, the city of Austin uh, should be or would be well suited to have a conversation instead of dictating to others what they're going to do. We asked the judge what measures he wants to see in order to help with the city's goals to end homelessness. The judge says he just wants better communication from Austin. Council will also vote on another related measure. It would allow the Austin city manager to talk about homeless housing opportunities with Williamson, Travis, and Hayes counties.